When I got to school, I was a completely different person. I remember showing up with two garbage bags and a guitar case and having no idea what to expect. So my college experience was incredible. The combination of really starting to discover who I was socially, learning things that were opening my mind about, you know, how the world works and how, you know, history impacts who we are today. And the environment of Buffalo itself was a really special place to be. There was one professor that impacted me profoundly, and that was Dr. Barber. Uh, he was such an interesting storyteller. My favorite memory with Dr. Barber was the last class that we had of the year, where we were sitting around talking about history from you know, the Ming Dynasty to today, how we didn't believe that uh, culture would still move at the same speed it used to, that we thought it would speed up. Working at Twitter is like working at the epicenter of culture. We can see world events happening at light speed. We can see trends and predictions that are coming in real time. And our company very much operates like that. When you think about technology today, it's not just about what you can do. It's about how it applies to us and becomes a better tool for humans. Studying the humanities, studying the arts is ultimately one way to really design the use for technology, not just what the technology is. And that's much more important. What a thrilling experience to come back to the campus after 16 years. Being able to see the students and talk to them and really try and dispel some of the myths like you need to know what you're doing today to end up where you want to go tomorrow uh, was really thrilling. Being honored by this award is, is one of the most humbling things um, I've ever experienced. Looking at the alumni that have been included and the current class today, I'm just thrilled and my hashtag is humbled. <laughs>